you haven't tried laying in a bed of clovers or laying in the grass in the sun, you should try it out. As long as it's comfy grass, not wet grass or dry grass. Soft, moist grass. And you don't seem to understand. like laying in clovers, Jonathan? You want to come lay in some clovers with me? Yes, come lay in this lovely bed of clovers and grass and a mixture of weeds. Come lay in this lovely bed of clovers with me. Come lay in the clovers. <laughs> it's comfy and it's soft. You could probably just fall asleep right here and now. I've been so busy all week. Oh, there's a bug on the camera. Lovely. But yes, I've been so busy. I had Jude's third birthday. I had my four year anniversary with Jonathan. And we went to Maggiano's, and that day was simply fantastic. We had a lot of fun that day. We got Jude a slide for his birthday. And there's just so many other really random things, some other big things that I had to get done. And that was pretty much my week, so. Mm. Mm. So, this painting I did in several different places. I uh, painted it in one spot and I painted it in another. I didn't. So, basically, this painting, I didn't have a direction that I was going at for this one, I didn't have a sketch or anything. I was basically going after some of the different colors. I really wanted to portray just a bunch of some of my favorite colors together. Well, I like all colors, but I really wanted to try new color scheme. And so this is what I ended up coming up with. So did you know I used to hate sitting in the sun so much because it would always give me more freckles? I don't mind sitting in it as much because I don't mind my freckles as much anymore. <laughs> I really liked the composition a lot for this piece, and especially all of the bright colors. I put five ravens in the piece overall, one holding a red ribbon, and the other one looking with more of a grim expression. You can see the red from the ribbon reflect in their eyes, although it's almost unnoticeable in the raven to the left. The moon drips steadily into the ocean in the background, giving the ocean a really lovely shimmer, I think. I don't know what the ribbon means exactly to the raven, but... It's her ribbon, and she could either be catching it or just letting it go. I thought that maybe the ribbon could stand for something passionate in the raven's life, something more literal, maybe it was given to her. The red could even be uh, viewed as more of an omen. You know, I'm leaving this one open to discussion, and for interpretation. The winners from the previous episode's contest are... Alright you guys, now it's time to pick the random subscriber for one of these pretty prints. And we have all the subscribers here. I'm going to shuffle them all a couple times. And pick. There you go. Winner, congratulations. Well, congratulations, you guys. I'll be sending you those prints in the mail of Uni Uni soon. This week I'm giving away two 4x6 inch prints of this week's <laughs> painting. And there are two ways to win them. One, all you have to do is be a subscriber to my channel, and that is it. And I'll be choosing someone completely at random. And then two, all you have to do is post a video or a text response about this painting. This week I'm doing a sort of free-for-all, so you can write a poem or just a comment on what you like about this week's artwork. And the most creative answer will win the second print. The other day I went to Dick Blake's 100th, 100th anniversary 
Jonathan and I both won two t-shirts <laughs> and got to, and we spun the wheel and won two t-shirts and Jude and Jacob both won uh, some Sharpie markers. And unfortunately my camera was pretty much dead, like it's about to die right now. So I wasn't really able to record much footage. I got a shot of some of the brushes that I really want though. Yep, my beautiful brushes, they're so expensive, but one day I'll be able to get them. Hmm, they're so pretty, pretty brushes. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye. Oh yes, I totally forgot to mention, right now I'm hosting a contest, a Corvus contest on DeviantArt.com, so if you guys are familiar with the website, you should check it out, or, I mean, if you're not familiar with the website, you should check it out because it's one of the biggest art community uh, websites, and it's completely free, and you can find tons of artists and art, and contest just so much stuff there, and so I'm giving away uh, tons of art prints from my shop, and bookmarks, and some of the postcards, and whatnot and so basically the contest is again the Corvus contest and you can submit up to two entries of an artwork and all it has to have is a Corvus type bird you now that's uh, crows and ravens and magpies and trees and there's tons of other types of Corvus uh, type birds and so there's a link in the description box below so you can go check it out if you're interested